missiles have gained a vital role in today's conflict due to their precision, speed, and versatility. Unlike ballistic missiles, cruise missiles have non-linear trajectories that may be adjusted in direction, altitude, and speed. As a result, they can deliver warheads across great distances with a high degree of precision. In addition, cruise missiles are classified according to their size, speed, subsonic, supersonic, range warhead configuration, and launch platform, land, air, surface ship, or submarine. The Brahmos cruise missile encapsulates these distinguishing features in a comprehensive state-of-the-art military system and one of the world's fastest supersonic cruise missiles. Hello and welcome to Naval Post again. Today, we are looking at the Brahmos missile, one of the fastest supersonic cruise missiles of the world and has a great potential to change the fate of the relentless war in the Indo-Pacific region. So, let's start with background and history. The Indo-Russian Brahmos program takes its name from combining the two countries' rivers, the Brahmaputra and the Moskova. It is a joint venture between the Russian Federation's NPO, Mishnostroyenia Rocket Design Bureau, NPOM, and the RDO, operating under Brahmos Aerospace. The joint venture was formed on 12 February 1998, with India holding a majority stake of 50.5%. The Brahmos cruise missile is a medium-range supersonic cruise missile based on the Russian P-800 Onyx cruise missile developed during the Cold War for use against big warships. General Features The Indian Navy IN inducted the Brahmos N-1 ship launched variant in 2005 aboard in Rajput, a destroyer class ship. After a successful test in 2008, the Universal Vertical Launch Module ULVM was configured on many Indian warships. However, the Quad Rebel Canistrize Inclined Launcher QCL or Quad has been developed aboard warships with insufficient space for a vertical launch module. Brahmos is the world's fastest supersonic cruise missile and can be launched from tri service platforms against targets in all three domains. An aircraft launched variant, Brahmos A, is configured for the Suhoi Su 30 MKI aircraft of the Indian Air Force. The Indian Air Force commissioned its first squadron of Brahmos in January 2020. It features a smaller booster and additional tail fins for more excellent stability during launch. The ship and land-based Brahmos missiles can carry a conventional semi-armor piercing warhead of 200 kg, while the aerial variant can take a 300 kg warhead. The deep penetration capabilities of the Brahmos were tested successfully in November 2013 at the Pokram Test Range in Rajasthan, India. The missile has some unique features. They are universal for multiple platforms, fire and forget principle of operation, high supersonic speed all through the flight, long flight range with varieties of flight trajectories, low radar signature, shorter flight times leading to lower target dispersion and quicker engagement, pinpoint accuracy with high lethal power, aided by considerable kinetic energy on impact. Specification The Brahmos is equipped with steel technology designed to make it less visible to radar and other detection methods. In addition, it has an inertial navigation system for use against ship targets and a global positioning system for use against land targets. Terminal guidance is achieved through an active or passive radar. In addition, Brahmos can attack surface targets by flying as low as 5 meters in altitude and the maximum height it can fly in 14,000 meters. It can gain a total speed of Mach 3 and has a maximum range of 450 kilometers. It has a two-stage propulsion system with a side propulsion rocket for initial acceleration and a liquid fueled ramjet responsible for the sustained supersonic cruise. Air breathing ramjet propulsion is much more fuel efficient than rocket propulsion giving the Brahmos a more extended range than a pure rocket-powered missile would achieve. Its 2.8 max speed means that some existing missile defense systems cannot intercept it and its precision makes it lethal to surface targets. The Brahmos missile has an identical configuration for land, sea, and subsea platforms. 
The air launched version has a smaller booster and additional tail fins for added stability during launch. Latest development. With a range of 290 to 300 kilometers and a top speed of Mach 3.5, the Brahmos Next Generation Cruise Missile will be 40% smaller and 50% lighter than the Brahmos I. As a result, the radar cross-section is drastically reduced, increasing the difficulty of detection and survivability in saturated air defense settings. Because of their smaller size and away, three next-generation variant missiles can be pilot-mounted on a single Sukhoi-30 MKI, increasing operational capabilities and assisting the aircraft's maneuverability. The design of the next-generation missile lends itself to placement in the standard torpedo tubes in the submarine launched version. If development proceeds as planned, the missile should be ready for flight tests in the coming years and induction in 2024. In October 2020, India successfully tested the missile from the indigenously built steel destroyer in Chennai. This is a significant step forward in India's maritime steel strike capability, allowing for steel and high speed of shore raids on enemy littoral targets and naval assets. Conclusion In short, Brahmos is the most modern missile system ever developed by India and Russia and has made India one of the leading countries in missile technology. Moreover, as the tension is rising in the Indo-Pacific region, Brahmos will be the main firepower missile for all branches of the Indian Army.